it was the way in which she made the food offering that more than anything else conveyed a sense of her intimate perception of the master after arranging the food she would address the master as one would a living person and say please come and take your food at jairambati she was often heard to tell the master on the jagadatri puja days oh lord finish your meal a little quickly today i have to attend the jagadatri puja this behavior of hers would be puzzling until it is understood that she actually used to visualize the master partaking of the food she used to say that he took it in three ways either he actually partook of the offering or a ray of light from his forehead touched the food or he only indicated his acceptance without actually partaking of the food never would she be satisfied until she found the master accepting the food and no food would she herself take unless it was accepted by him